create our cloud, for this experiment, we are going to use a two liter bottle. We're going to use a soda pump. We're gonna use some rubbing alcohol. And we just put about a teaspoon of rubbing alcohol in here. We're gonna check the temperature before we start. And you can see if you look closely that right now, the temperature is currently about 79. And you're gonna feel the pressure build up. As the pressure builds up, the temperature should be changing. And we can see it's already jumped to 82. It's building up. It's currently moving its way up to 86. So we're raising the pressure and we're increasing the temperature. I can also feel the bottle. You can feel the air pushing against the bottle. So the air pressure is building up and building up and building up. We are gonna remove that pressure very quickly in just a moment. All right, so as I'm pressing, you can see the temperature um, increasing. We've gone up from where we started, which was here, and it's now up at 82, and I can't get any more pressure into the bottle. So I'm gonna hold it here and watch what's gonna happen. You see that? We formed a cloud, and then watch. I'm gonna shine my laser, and you should be able to see the cloud pressure. Can you see the cloud that we created? All right, so what happened? We exerted pressure in our bottle. As we did that, we caused the temperature to go up. When we removed the pressure, the temperature went down. That caused all of the alcohol molecules that were floating along to collide together and form that visible cloud. You ready to go learn some more about clouds? Come on. As part of being a cloud detective today, we're gonna to go outside into our yard, look up and take a look at the clouds around us. Now, a couple of ground rules before we go. Do we ever, ever look directly at the sun? No, we don't wanna hurt our eyes. Um, you're gonna to wanna to have your notebook and your piece of paper. You can also take and investigate the Sky Today piece of paper. I have it available on our blog for you. It came from our friends at NISNET. We are gonna be participating in Globe Observer today, helping NASA track the clouds. Are you ready to go? Come on.